believe what I am doing is good and what I'm standing up against is evil. So for me, you know, I, I really didn't want to make a sort of policy film. There's been many great docs about uh, the drug war, about the border, um, about these issues. Uh, I wanted to tell a story about the cartels through the people that are affected by them. I wanted to tell a story by being on the ground, by being immersed in this world, um, and, and, and telling it some, from a sort of first-person perspective, uh, without talking heads, without experts. And I ended up going on this crazy journey um, with these two different groups. El gobierno no proporciona las garantías de seguridad que el pueblo necesita. Nos podemos armar. The film, you know, is, especially in, on the Mexico side of the story, I, I thought I was telling this very simple hero villain story of guys in, in white shirts fighting against guys in black hats. And um, the sort of classic Western narrative uh, quickly changed. Um, and I realized that the lines between good and evil were, were quite blurry. Anybody touches me, drop them. You savvy? I'm so honored to be here at, at AFI Docs. You know, I've, I was here with my last film, Escape Fire. Um, and it's just an incredible festival. Um, you know, showing some of the best documentaries out there. Um, you know, I feel very honored and, and humbled to be here. Um, but it also just brings together, you know, the whole doc community. It sort of descends on, on Washington for a few days in, um, in, Silver, in Silver Spring. And um, it's, it's, it's fun, you know, it's just great to be around your colleagues and, 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 and uh, be able to see all these amazing films. So you know, I'm just grateful to be here and, and excited that this, this festival exists. Okay, ¿quién trabajas? We're the lucky ones, or not? Ustedes lo están viendo es porque yo ya dejé de existir. <laughs>